Continuing coverage now, the mold issues at the Hamlin County Courthouse. People who work there are gathering right now to demand safer conditions inside the building. 22 News reporter Taylor Knight is live outside the courthouse in downtown Springfield. We are outside of the Hamden County Courthouse, also known as the Roderick Ireland Courthouse here in downtown Springfield. I want to show you what's going on here behind me. Members of the Hamden County Bar Association, as well as other groups and organizations that work inside of this building are starting to gather right now. They're demanding safer working conditions. They want the building to be healthier for people who work inside of it because of the mold. Now, take a look at the pictures that the Hamden County Bar Association took in side of this courthouse. They show mold in different areas of the building from the hallways to courtrooms to lockup cells. Trial Court Chief Justice Paula Carey and Court Administrator John Bellow are expected to be here in Springfield today. According to a spokesperson from the trial court, they'll be giving Secretary of the Executive Office for Administration and Finance Michael Heffernan a tour of the courthouse here. They will all then meet with court department leaders, District Attorney Anthony Galuni, Sheriff Nick Kochi, and members of the legislative delegation. The courthouse reopened last Thursday after being closed for two weeks because of the mold. Testing found mold levels to be safe for people after extensive cleaning and sanitation, but the Hamden County Sheriff's Department and the DA's office will not be sending staff or inmates into the building just yet. The tests that were done did not include testing on the air ducts. We will have continuing coverage of this gathering tonight at 22 News starting at 5. Working for you in Springfield, Taylor Knight, 22 News.